Hey everyone, so this is my keep it sweet under five minutes update. Um, I'm going to be cutting a lot of my videos shorter just because I think that I ramble. So um, I'm really going to make this one under five minutes, I promise this time. Um, I am 14 weeks in a day, so if Veda is measuring like she should be, um, which are, well, like she has been, she'll be measuring three days ahead, which will put me at about 14.4 right now. Um, so I kind of just wanted to let you guys know that, um, I've had a couple of requests for my Instagram page because I think I've talked about it before and I've never actually shared the link. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and include the link in the description. Um, it is my personal Instagram, but I wouldn't really call it personal, um, just because I'm very open about, like, my pregnancy and, like, um, even my Facebook page is all about, you know, what we've been through and um, you know I don't I don't hide it from friends or family like our journey or anything um, so it's gonna have a lot of um, a lot of my pregnancy posts like my belly pictures and you'll get to see my dogs and things like that but um, you will get to see a lot more of my belly growing um, more of like flashbacks from when we were trying things like that so um, it it'd definitely be pretty fun I guess um, if you guys want to peek and um, take a look at it it is public so you don't actually have to follow me. Um, I'm not really concerned about that. I just wanted to share it with you guys and let you know that it is there. And um, if you do want to look at it, as I said, I'll link it in the description. Um, let me think if there's anything else that I really want to go over in this video. Um, Veda has been moving up. I can feel her. She is a hard little ball. And... Um, I can feel her when she's at a certain position in my belly now. Um, it's just like a really hard ball and then that ball will go away. Um, I will say that I have not had any kicks um, and I really haven't got any flutters recently either which concerned me. Um, but she's still okay so I have no concerns there. Um, we leave Friday for our vacation so when I hit 15 weeks I will update you guys. And I'll be in Daytona, so that'll be awesome. Um, other than that, that's really kind of all I have this week. It's been a pretty boring week. Um, my next ultrasound is at 16 weeks. We'll be able to confirm that Veda is a girl. Um, so that's going to be exciting. We'll get to see how big she is again. Um, I have been told by multiple people that I look like I'm having twins. So I've also had a couple people tell me that they didn't know that they had twins until later on because the tech would find baby one and they don't look for baby two so um just because i've like normally they they'll go on one side of my stomach and they'll be like oh, okay there's baby one but then they never look for anything else so i'm gonna try to get my doctor to look around and make sure that there's not two in there but um other than that that's kind of my week it's been pretty slow um so i will go ahead and show you guys my belly, I do have shorts on this time, so I'll be able to actually share you, share with you like an actual belly picture. Um, so here's the belly. Um, it's very low as of right now. You can tell that my uterus is below my belly button. And yes, I have a tattoo here. So I'm kind of skeptical on what's gonna happen with that. I've already had to take out my belly button ring because I can feel my stomach pulling like this and this way and it was kind of bothering me. But, um, here's the belly. So it's definitely a little bit of a baby bump. Um, it's different for me because I am very skinny and I've always had a flat stomach. So even though this bump may not look very big to most people, it is big to me. Um, it is odd that, I, that when I look down, I have a belly. Um, I wish I could flip this camera around to show you. But I can actually see that she, from last night, she's still kind of sitting on my left side. Um, I don't know if you can tell, but it's pretty flat over here. And then you can see that she's a little bit more bumped, bumped up over there, and it's very hard over that in that area. So I'm not sure. Um, my sciatic pain, my sciatic nerve pain has went from my left hip to my right hip, so that's fun. Um, other than that, I've been pretty decent. Um, it's getting really hot out, so I'm going to head back inside um, and probably eat a pizza. Not a good choice, 
but I'm at this point I'm trying to gain weight I lost weight in my first trimester and I'm already very skinny I was already underweight so it's very important that I'm gaining weight um, I have gained a pound and a half so that's like a big thing for me um, and I've kept it on so even though like I know you can gain weight healthily but you don't understand if I'm not taking in a massive amount of calories I will lose weight it's just who I am I'm not anorexic, I don't have an eating disorder, I eat a lot. Um, my whole family, on both sides of my family, are very, very, very skinny. Um, so it's just kind of who I am, it's kind of who my whole family is. After my mom had both of her kids, me and my sister, she went back down, and my mom weighs 130 pounds. Um, so she weighs very close to what I weigh currently. She weighed less than I did when she was pregnant with both of us. So anyway, so don't criticize me on my food choices. But um, that's it. I've already went over my five, almost at six minutes, so I'm going to try to cut it short um, for the next video. But anyway, that's my update for 14 weeks. So I will see you guys then. As I said, Instagram will be linked in the description, so you can follow me there. Um, other than that, thank you guys for watching, and I'll keep you updated.